These are the final moments of episode 40 in the ongoing summit eruption at Kilauea Volcano. High lava fountains are reduced to spatter and flame in just a matter of seconds. This view was taken from a public viewing area near the Volcano House inside Hawaii Volcanoes National Park. A crowd of onlookers cheered the finish of the event. The nearly 10-hour episode produced the kind of dramatic visuals that volcano enthusiasts have come to expect in this year-long eruption. But it's the events that follow that have caught the eye of scientists. Swarms of small earthquakes are now occurring beneath the caldera. This is the first time such swarms have been detected since the eruption began in December 2024. The latest lava activity itself was much like the 39 previous episodes. This time, only one vent was producing high fountains. Also, due to wind conditions at the summit, ash and tephra was reported to be raining down in the Uwe Kahuna public viewing area. No injuries were reported. The USGS Hawaiian Volcano Observatory says the episode produced 7.1 million cubic yards of lava, equal to 5.5 million cubic meters. The average effusion rate was approximately 250 cubic yards per second, the same as 190 cubic meters. The abrupt end of episode 40 came just after 6 p.m. on Monday evening. After midnight, the first earthquake swarm began. It lasted for half an hour. The second swarm occurred on Wednesday morning, and a third later that evening. All three swarms lasted about the same amount of time and have been spread out beneath the east side of the crater and the south caldera. The earthquakes have been less than magnitude 2, with most being magnitude 1 or smaller. The swarms are occurring at a depth of 1 to 3 miles or 1.5 to 5 kilometers. They are said to be volcano-tectonic earthquakes that accompany crack opening due to magmatic pressure. The observatory says it is yet to be determined if these swarms will have an impact on future lava fountaining activity at the surface. In an information statement, the geologists wrote, Volcanic systems remain a complex balance of magmatic pressure and strength of the surrounding rocks. If the rocks weaken, one possible outcome is injection of magma into a fracture, creating a dike. If the magma breaches the surface, a new vent might be created, shifting the focus of the eruption. Historically, episodic fountain eruptions can cease when the magma supply is diverted in this manner. There is currently no observable evidence that magma is migrating away from this area. The USGS volcano alert level remains at watch, and the next episode of high lava fountains could occur later this month if there are no dramatic changes at the Hawaii Island volcano.